Imagine you're standing outside on a super windy day. You feel the wind pushing against you, making it harder to walk. Now imagine that same wind hitting a tall building or a huge bridge. The force of the wind pushing from the outside is an example of an external force, a force that acts on a structure from the outside. External forces are forces that come from outside a structure and can cause it to bend, twist, or even collapse if it's not built strong enough. These forces can come from wind, water, the weight of people or vehicles, or even the force of an earthquake. Engineers need to understand and plan for these forces so structures can stand strong and not fall apart. One of the biggest external forces is gravity. It's always pulling everything toward the ground. If you jump, gravity pulls you back down. If you stack blocks too high without balancing them, gravity pulls them over. Every building, bridge, and tower has to be designed to handle gravity's constant downward force. If the materials can't support the weight, the structure can collapse. Another huge external force is wind. On a calm day, you don't think much about it, but during storms or hurricanes, wind can be powerful enough to knock over trees and rip roofs off houses. That's why skyscrapers are designed to flex slightly so they don't break in strong winds. Suspension bridges also sway a little to absorb the force of the wind instead of fighting against it. If structures were too stiff, the wind could push too hard and cause them to crack or fall. Water is another powerful force. Have you ever watched waves crash against rocks at the beach? Over time, those waves wear down the rocks. That same force can erode buildings and roads near oceans and rivers. When rivers flood, they push against bridges and houses. And if the water's strong enough, it can knock them down. That's why flood barriers and strong foundations are important for buildings near water. Then there's the force of moving objects. Imagine a car crashing into a wall. It hits with a huge amount of force. Bridges and guardrails on highways are designed to absorb impact so they don't break apart when hit by vehicles. Even stadiums have to be built strong enough to handle thousands of people jumping and moving at the same time. External forces are all around us, acting on structures every day. Gravity pulls down, wind pushes, water erodes, and moving objects crash. Engineers have to plan carefully so that structures can resist these forces and stay standing. Next time you see a bridge, a tall building, or even a playground structure, think about all the external forces trying to push, pull, or shake it and how it was designed to stay strong.